Um, Oh. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. This? <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh, let me introduce myself. Uh, my name is Jessica Cindy. Um, uh, today I will demonstrate on how to uh, create a flower dome. Uh, why I created this flower dome is um, actually influenced by the first idea of um, why. Uh, we have this uh, five bags, simply flowers design, which is uh, very luxurious detail, very couture details. And this dome is represent uh, the stroller. And then the flowers inside is represent the beautiful baby. So the dome um, represent of the protection and uh, side bag flower, simply flowers stroller uh, protect uh, your beautiful baby. Yeah. And let's start with uh, preparing the base of the dough. So you can actually remove the glass uh, dough. Just put it uh, right beside you because later on you need to um, measure the height of the flower. So it's better to just put it like right beside. And then you can take up the preserved flowers. You can cut or you can untie the ribbon and then just place uh, each individual into like uh, five group. Uh, uh, video clear or there is a white color thing blocking the video right now? Uh, no, it's very clear. Oh, okay, okay. Because on my screen there is a white color. It's fine. Eh? Okay, okay, sure. Okay. Okay. Uh, you can separate it into like um, individual group. You will have like one, two, three, four, five. And you can see here that is the three color styrofoam. Uh, for me, usually I will start with the main flowers, which my main flower is Daisy. You can choose what is your main flower. You can choose like Daisy or this um, Billy Button, or either you want to have this, the rabbit, the rabbit tail. Yeah. And you can place this as how I place in this sample. Yeah, we'll see or they see us. Yeah, so I put one in the center and then slightly lower uh, just beside it and then in between like in between like high and low and then the other one like lower here. So try to put um, everything in different height to make it like more 3D. You can like roughly measure it. So for example, this one is a bit too high. So maybe I can cut it like a little bit shorter. And like that. So for our Daisy, uh, represent uh, purity and innocence, just like um, when the baby born and they are very innocent, they're very pure in Europe. Um, they also use it for traditional medicine for skin, like for example, you have like redness or either also for a bone and for other like um, skin like eczema. You can place it um, 
as the base uh, how you want the silhouette to be. If, if you prefer something like asymmetrical, you can create something like this, everything different height. If you prefer something symmetrical, then you can like uh, do right and left similar height. For me, I like something organic. So I will place everything like, this is like too similar. So I will do it slightly shorter, this area. Flower dome, uh, you can decide if you prefer to have it like one side or uh, 360 degree. Like for me, usually I prefer to do it one side because it's um, uh, when I take a picture, I will just focus on one side. So most of my flowers is facing front, it's more photogenic, but um, if you are planning to place it in, uh, for example, in the dinner table that there is uh, your guests that are gonna view it in different angle. You can do it like 360 degree. Okay, I'll just do it one side. And make sure it's not too slanted. So when you cover it with dome, it won't like, hit the glass. One, uh, next one we can we can do the pink uh, Billy pattern. So this one uh, symbolizes a good health. Yeah, so I wish that your uh, baby gonna have a good health and smooth delivery. <laughs> this one, um, you can place it like in between uh, the height of the current daisy, or if you want the daisy to be like completely stand up, you can place the Billy button uh, lower than uh, most of the daisies. Everyone doing okay? Yeah, <laughs> I think everyone's focused. <laughs> <laughs> Figure out how it looks like. We need some music. <laughs> Is it after awesome talking to yourself? Should we like also chat with you? Ah, it's up to you. <laughs> <laughs> Good as Gerald. <laughs> mm. No, sorry, that's my baby. <laughs> It's okay, you can have your whole baby join us too. <laughs> um, it's more, it's more. I can see a uh, Georgina flower, but the rest I can't really see, so. <laughs> <laughs> So I like to place uh, some of the flowers like really low. So later on when I place all the fillers, I can still see my main flowers to create the more 
3D and 3D effect, 3D and more lively. Okay. We can move on to, to the next uh, main flower, the third one, which is this uh, bunny tail. The bunny tail is um, is something more playful and fun. I think baby will love to play with this bunny tail. <laughs> For bunny tail, you can also place uh, lower than um, belly button, or you can have different height as long as lower than your number one main flower. So if your number one main flower is daisy, then as long as lower than daisy, then it will like take the attention. Uh, if you notice there is like different different like height uh, I will recommend like the longer one you can place it a little bit lower and then the tiny bunny tail you can place it like a little bit higher So all this uh, flowers is preserved flower. It is a real flower that um, go through the preserve process. And for preserve, there is many ways to preserve the flowers. You can also do it yourself. For example, if you have like fresh blooms that uh, you receive it from someone you can actually just like tie the flower with the, the tin drop just now, and then you can hang it upside down somewhere like near the sun. And depends on the depends on the heat. If it's in Singapore, probably within two three weeks. Uh, you should get to see your flowers start to um, have the preserve effect. But there is many ways to preserve the flower. Like some, um, they use like a special machine or either the silica gel. Yeah, I've tried um, doing that with the silica gel and forgot about them. <laughs> well, forgot <laughs> about removing the silica gel? Yeah. How, how is I left that? It, I think I, la I left it for over two weeks because I forgot about it. So what, what is the, the final effect after two weeks? <laughs> <laughs> is um, it moving to something else? <laughs> Not what I expected. None, nothing crazy, but um, it was definitely not what I expected. Is it the same color or it turns to... No, darker, yeah. It's still the same color. No, it was darker. Oh, it was darker. Yeah, mm -hmm. unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, are you guys done with the, the bunny tail? 
If you are done with the bunny tail. Um, My daughter wants to say hi. Her name is Bunny. Bunny, hello. Hi, Bunny. Hi, so baby. Hi, baby. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? Which flower? Hey, are you? Which flower do you like? <laughs> she what just came. Bunny tail? Yeah, this is Bunny. We call bunny. her Bunny, so yeah. <laughs> say bye-bye. <laughs> you can join us. <laughs> so perfect. <laughs> okay, yeah. are you guys ready to continue on the? Oh, okay. Maybe we 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 do this one first. Uh, so this one is the uh, filler. This one is uh, asparagus fern. Uh, for this one, be careful because there is a lot of uh like sharp things. So just just in case, just be careful when you hold it. And you will feel like a little bit like sticky, but it's okay later on, like you can <laughs> wash your hand. So this one is, has a little bit of sticky, um, like feel on the stem. For this one, uh, this is the filler. So uh, I will recommend to put it like really low. So around like this area. Mm -hmm to feel as much until you can't see the gray styrofoam. Okay. And then the rest, because we can do the last one. Yeah, so you can cut it like this. If this is too high, uh, I will just place it at the back. Yes. Is it okay if I remove because I can't see Gerald? The, this one, the group. <laughs> oh yeah, now I yeah now I can see Gerald and Teresa <laughs> because it was like there is something blocking. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's really nice. <laughs> So is this the first time you guys doing a flower arrangement or like uh, holding the piece of flowers? <laughs> is it you guys first time? I'm doing it. Yeah. Doing it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Is it like difficult or it's fine? It's fine. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite fragile, especially for the main fern. Um, it's a little bit like dropping, so just just be careful. Like it's gonna be like a little bit messy. And for the, like this area, you can put like really short, like three or two centimeter kind of mint fern. This one, a uh, piece of flowers, uh, can last even like uh, for one to two years or more. So if you want to use it. For... Sorry? Sorry. Sorry, I can hear just now. Is someone asking something? 
Yeah, so uh, you can you can uh, use this for Christmas also, and then you can just put like uh, you can buy a small fairy light, and then just like put it like over decorated like a pink Christmas tree, or you can also buy um, Christmas ball, and then you can decorate it here. You can also put your baby picture. So you can just slot it somewhere here. Put family picture or baby picture. Let me know if you are done with this one. It's okay if the center you you still have like some like blank space like holes in between in the center because later on we will put one more uh, flowers but the side try to fill up with the main fern. If you like it to um, have this area all covered with the pink, you can just like take a longer one and like this. Yeah, like that. Amelia, are you done with your flowers? More or less, I think. Although what? So fast? Are I, you... probably, I probably um Sorry, I'm very that. slow. <laughs> no, 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 because I probably screwed me, up. Me too, me too. I'm slow. <laughs> I'm really taking my time. <laughs> I'm very slow. Can yep. we see flowers? <laughs> Can we see your flowers, Amelia? <laughs> sure. No, because I think I screwed up at the start because when you said put the flowers, I actually put the, the main fern on first. So that kind of you put the main anchored, fern. that anchored the whole arrangement instead. I'll oh. show you. Let me just tidy it up. Okay. <laughs> oh but Gerald are you done yours looks like completely done I I, I don't know if I'm doing it right <laughs> can I see from is this is this the front I've uh is that is that supposed to be a front uh do you have your front or they uh, had a 60 degree I I was just like this poking la. <laughs> yeah, I think that's nice. Maybe decide if you want to make like some uh shorter one to to give like more 3D effect. So let's say um like some of oh. the in front you can cut it like if you want you can just cut it on top because you can actually for main front you can't really see 
Like which one is top, which one is bottom. So, so cut this part, is it? Like the, the top part, trim the top part. Uh, for the for only this, not this one. <laughs> for for this one. This one, you right? Can trim it like when you trim oh, hair, okay. like hair. So like trim. up and down, up and down. Uh, like for me, I will put like the tall one at the back, and then like front here is like like high and low, but it's like gradually from here to slowly lower okay. the mountain. But you can also do it like this way, which is like, it's like a pom-pom. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Are you planning to put it in your dining table or Beside your bed. <laughs> okay, I almost done. Just add a little bit at the back, then I'm done. You can always like rearrange it. Um, for example, if uh, later on you want to mix like other flowers like white or yellow or peach or purple, you can just like adding on or remove some easily. Yeah, you can get uh you can get piece of flowers uh, almost like any florist in Singapore. If if you want to do a fresh flowers, you need to change the sponge at the bottom to a green color sponge that you can soak it inside the water. So the flower will last like a little bit longer. Oh, that's a good tip. Okay, and the last one is this one. Okay, so this one is uh, rascus, and it symbolizes uh, thoughtfulness. Yeah, it's a very very um meaningful leaf. And it's also used to help uh, on the redness. Uh, I'm not sure how they do it, but yeah, this is a powerful uh, plant. For this one, um, for me, I will do it like, I will try to cover uh, the stem so I don't see so much stem. So I will maybe like cover it like here, 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 here. Yeah. If you have um, bigger space, for example, like it's not for this dome, but you just want to do this as a centerpiece uh, without a dome. You can also like make this into like a very dramatic uh, arrangement, like dramatic centerpiece for your center table, then you can put all your food and high tea all at the side without the dome. But if you want to cover it with the dome, then you have to uh, make sure that everything is like in the size of the dome. Yeah. For example, I have this branches and I I will try to cover it with this so I don't really see. I I prefer not to see too much branches. And if the leaves and too close to the stem, you can just like pluck it. Like this. Okay. 
Okay. How's your flower, uh, Asika? Um, it's getting there. <laughs> I'm very <Okay>. slow. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a particular time. <laughs> um, and for preserved flowers, because uh, if you don't really like the smell, because sometimes like the, the first smell is like a little bit strong and um, you can actually spray it with perfume. Ah, yeah, okay. or either maybe you can place um, like essential oil or something. So it will, it will stay quite sometimes inside because this is like the very fresh with a flower, so there is a little bit of like a strong smell. Teresa, is your main flower is the bunny? No, I my I didn't have the daisies, but I have some flowers at home, so I just took some like you didn't the have yellow them? one. Yeah, I didn't get the daisies, but it's okay. Oh. I have some flowers at home, so I just got some like yellow. <laughs> oh no, I'm so sorry. No, no problem. It gives me room to improvise. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. So what what flower you are using right now? The yellow and the purple is the belly uh, the belly button, right? Yeah, I just got uh the pink belly button and the yellow one is my main flower. I don't know. Okay, yellow one. Is it a fresh flower? So no, it's preserved as well. Oh, it's also preserved. Yeah, oh, then I also have like these white ones, so I just use them. Oh wow, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hmm. So you arrange uh, your own like uh, flower arrangement like at home, like the display at home. Yeah, just just for fun. <laughs> Nothing like this. <laughs> yeah, after this, <laughs> you can yeah. do like I can learn how. To... Yeah, I can try this. It's quite fun. Yeah. You can, if you want to do in fresh flowers, it's also the same way of doing it. It's just like for fresh flowers, then um, you need to put the green sponge and soak it inside the water. Oh, I don't like fresh flowers because if you don't maintain them, then they become, they, they rot. Yeah. And then and it becomes stinky. <laughs> yeah. Or you can consider like the fresh flowers that can be dried nicely. <laughs> Yeah, I, I always dry them. Like eucalyptus, yeah. I always dry and it's very nice. Yeah, eucalyptus has a very nice smell too. Yeah. Okay, I'm almost done. How's Gwen? How's your flower? <laughs> I don't have space to put anything anymore. <laughs> oh, wow, that's so nice. Yeah, this one is like you cover everything, right? The bottom. I think I have to put by the sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very nice. You can actually cover the whole black color and it looks like more dramatic. 
Okay, I'm done. Let me clear a little bit here. They're very messy. Oops, sorry. And actually, um, if you want to experiment other thing, you don't have to do it with preserved flowers only. Even like if you want to do it uh, fabric flowers or any other decoration like like the the Christmas um, ball, if you want to like um, make it into a Christmas a small Christmas tree with a small Christmas ball, you can also just uh, stack it. Uh, the easiest way will be with the glue gun. And then you can ship it and then you can put inside the room. Yeah, there is there is many ways to like reuse this again. But for this, you can use it for, you can keep it inside here for uh, at least one, two years. Yeah, and you can spray some perfume. Yeah. How is it? So this, my arrangement. Nice. Hello, so cute. <laughs> What's her name, Amelia? What's your name? What's your name? So cute. What's your name? Emmy. Emmy. Her name is Emmanuel, Hi. but we call her Emmy. Hi, Emmy. You're so beautiful. <laughs> Do you like flowers? You like flowers? Yes. Yes? Which one is your favorite? What's your favorite color? Purple. Purple. Okay. <laughs> then mommy needs to buy a purple piece of flowers <laughs> mix it in between. <laughs> Let me know if you guys done. <laughs> okay. Wow, Gerald, one is quite dramatic. I can see like the top, like <laughs> very dramatic. <laughs> yeah, very nice. Very couture. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna like try to cover it with the this mine the second one it might be like a little bit too open up <laughs> but let me try it okay For the bottom one, if it's too long, don't worry, you can trim it later. But for now, I will just like push it in. So the glass room always remind me of the fairy tale story. Just like when I see the <laughs> stroller, is I feel it's like come from like the fairy tale storybook. Like it's so magical. And just now I can see like I, I push like I mean when uh, Christina push it 
So uh, we are in center point now. And then I can see like, okay, this is like a very fashion outstanding. And I think like, mm, I can imagining this, like I push this stroller in Paris in fashion week. And yeah, everyone will like, wow, like so um, uh, beautiful, so magical. And I think we'll bring like uh, many smile to whoever look at this stroller and the baby, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you guys happy with your flowers? Yeah, it's very nice. How how do we get the the bottom stuff out? The bottom stuff, like you know, like all the all the little things here. Can we just pour it? Yeah. It's Actually, you can just like this. Oh, and it comes out. Yeah. Like, oh, it won't drop. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hold the, if you're scared, if the arrangement is a lot, you can just hold the gray sponge and then you can just do it upside down. Throw it inside oh. the Yeah. But um, the mint fern, um, uh, it's still like easily drop. You can try to uh, put it like that. But uh, this one, I'm not sure if you have like, there is this spray. It's actually, it's a glue spray that you can spray on uh, for flowers like this mint fern or um, pampas. Mm -hmm. You know, like pampas, uh, it's also drop a lot. You can spray like yeah, a glue spray. spray. Oh, I use hairspray for my pampas. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, pampas, you can use hairspray. Uh, I haven't tried like hairspray for this piece of flowers. Yeah, so I, I tried before with the with the glue spray. You can buy it uh, in Art Friend. It's a very beautiful like leaf, but I know it's like really like dropping a lot. <laughs> so, so I need to seal it inside this door. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the tip. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, it will be a very beautiful like centerpiece for for your dinner table or for your side table or uh, yeah for Christmas. I think it will be beautiful if you buy like the small uh the short version of the fairy light and then you can just put it inside. You can hide the battery inside all the main fern. Yeah. Okay, if you guys ready, we can take one picture from memory. <laughs> so many. before we end the workshop no thank no. you it was so fun thank you so much yeah thank you <laughs> that was so nice thank short you. lesson uh help you to create more and more like beautiful flowers arrangement at home or for your friends thank you thank you so much that was a good break <laughs> <laughs> uh, baby carry yeah. <laughs> thank you
Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye.